Think it. Make it. Trade it. More than a trading platform. We welcome you to visit us at www.prodigiorts.com. Hello, and thank you for joining us. This is a tutorial on how to backtest your strategies within Wizard Lab using the Prodigio RTS platform. Once you have logged in, look along the top of the screen here. You're going to see a list of tabs. Select the Wizard Lab tab. And let's move right to step three, backtesting. If you do not have a strategy opened up, select the Open button and pick a strategy from the list of strategies that you have saved. And now that you have one opened, here you can see the name of the strategy, the author, the date it was created, the date it was last modified. And next here we have the description of the strategy if you had entered in a description when you created it. Here you can actually type in an individual symbol that you would like to backtest. All you have to do is type in the symbol and then select the green run button right down here. There we can see what the results were for the time frame we have selected. If you like, you can actually select an entire list from this pull down menu right here. And what's really great is if you wanted to create your own list that you wanted to backtest, you can actually create one simply by clicking this little icon here and entering all the symbols that you wanted to save in your own list here. And I'm not going to go into great detail on how to create your own list, but if you go to our website, www.prodigiorts.com, select the Video Archive tab, and then from there you can select the Training Videos tab, you will see a video called How to Manage Your Quotes Panel. And within that video, I give a really detailed overview on how to create your own lists. And as you see here, I am just typing in the symbols that I want to save in my list. I click the Save button, and now you can see here it is. My List 2 is actually the name of the list that we created. And in our pull down menu, there it is. Now we have My List 2 amongst all the other lists that are located here by default. Next on our list here, we have another drop down tab. It says simulated portfolio backtest, or you have another choice that says raw mode backtest. And when you have raw mode backtest selected, you're basically telling RTS to assume that there are no restrictions on capital. And with the simulated portfolio backtest selected, you can actually go in and change the settings for the backtesting only. Remember, this is just for backtesting. It does not affect your live risk settings, which is located here. Remember, they're different. One is for backtesting and the others for robotic trading. So next on our list, we can actually select the start and end date of which we want to run the backtest. You can actually go back a full year. And next here, what you really want to be aware of in the commissions area is that it's set to per share. So let's go ahead and select the run button and see what we come up with. And here we go. Here are all of our results. There is a profit of $226.89. We have seven winners and two losers. Go ahead and select the charts tab here in our results, and we can get a visual on what our strategy did for us. And here we can see the entry and exit points. And this is really helpful when you're creating your own strategies to make sure that it's doing exactly what you're asking it to do. And finally, if you wanted to export your results so that you can further analyze them, you can go down here to the bottom right-hand side of the screen and save it to your computer. And that concludes our tutorial on backtesting in Wizard Lab using the Prodigio RTS platform. Thank you for joining us, and as always, we can be reached at support at prodigiorts.com. Nothing contained in this education tutorial video constitutes a solicitation, recommendation, promotion, or endorsement of any particular security, other investment, product, transaction, or investment. We do not give investment advice or advise anyone on the value of securities or other investment instruments. We do not recommend trades or transactions in securities or other financial instruments. Investment-related information we provide is for educational and informational purposes only, and no trade ideas or other references we make to a particular security is a recommendation to buy, sell, or hold that or any other security, any portfolio of securities, or to affect any transaction or investment strategy. None of the information we provide is tailored to your investment needs or the investment needs of any person. We do not guarantee that following any of the information we provide will result in profitable investment activities. We do not warrant or guarantee the accurateness, completeness, 
or adequacy of the information we provide. Any use of information from this educational tutorial is entirely at your own risk.